Let's do this. <laughs> Well, hello there. My name is Val, and what I want to tell you guys today is that I'm feeling well today. Yes, yes, I am. Let's start this off with a montage of what this video actually is about my collection of books. So as you've noticed, I've actually changed my shirt because I want to look decent in this video where I talk about my books. So first of all, I started book collecting when I went to college because I was deprived of buying books when I was in high school. So I'm gonna start off by showing you the books I bought during my first year in college. And here we go. So the first book I ever bought when I went to college is this, Chicken Soup for the Soul, Campus Chronicles, because, well, when I bought this book, I thought, I'm going to college, so maybe this would help me because it's 1001 inspirational, supportive, and humorous stories about life in college, but I haven't actually read this book. I just read some stories because... That there are so many quotations. Let me give you one by Sherry Carter Scott. Remember, there are no mistakes, only lessons. Love yourself, trust your choices, and every day is possible. Some cute bird here. The U looks like a chicken. The mascot in KFC. <laughs> Here is another quote that I love by this very famous person named Author Unknown. If you are ashamed to stand by your colors, you had better seek another flag. Yeah, maybe I'll get the time to read all the stories in this book, but I've already graduated in college. But Maybe you, this would help you if you went to college, maybe you buy this one. Another book I bought during my first year in college was this book, The Last Song by Nicholas Parks. Because I bought this book because the movie was about to come out. So I thought why not read the book first before watching the movie. But I read the book. It's usual drama, story where someone dies because as everyone knows Nicholas Sparks likes killing people and I am a person who loves reading those drama books where a family member or maybe a friend dies because that's I think that's much more relatable to me yeah so this is one of the good books I ever bought a little old already, you can see that it has it's already turned brownish and I love this one. Um and then there was this time when I bought two books at once. Because maybe I just had too much money. This books the wicked lovely and ink exchange. And it's about fairies. Every book has different stories. Um, it doesn't really follow the example. This first book, this first book has a different character. This book also has a different character. And I bought this book because I find it very different because usually books, 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 like three years ago, books that were very well known are about vampires or maybe vampires. I wasn't much of a reader back then, but I just love the thought of having books around. So I love this two books. Maybe I'd read it soon again. Yeah. Another book I bought is another Nicholas Sparks novel, and it's The Notebook. 
I don't know why I bought this. And during that time, I just thought of having a collection of Nicholas Sparks books. And most people said that the movie was much better than the book. So, we'll just have to see about that. Yes. So, maybe I will continue this book collection video of mine. Because I still have tons of books to show you. And that's it for now. I love the cover of this book. I don't like the cover of this book. Yes. I actually bought this because of the cover.